So originally I really was trying to film a morning routine for you guys, but in this season that I'm in right now, nothing has been the same. Our mornings have all been different. It's just been kind of crazy. I do want to get on into a good morning routine and schedule, but I'm not going to push it. We are where we're at. So it made me think of doing this video just because it's funny and we all get that sometimes life happens. Good morning, friends. Every morning, I like to wake up at 5.30 in the morning to get a head start on the day. I try to get up at 6.30 every morning so that I can get a head start. Every morning, I like to let my body tell me naturally when it's time to wake up. I feel like being so in tune with my body really helps me to get the best start to my day. I like to set my clothes out the night before, this ensures I don't have to stress about what I'll wear the next day. I can already feel that this is gonna be a great day. I like to brush my teeth and do my complete morning skincare routine. I would take a shower, but I plan to work out later, so I decided to go with my five second natural look makeup routine for now. I gently wake up the kids and have morning snuggles. We don't put a time limit on all this love being shared. Time to get up. Wake up. We're late. Hurry up. You, come on. I assist the younger ones in brushing their teeth and doing their hair so that I can set the example that if we look our best, we'll do our best. I like to teach my kids to multitask. That way I can set realistic expectations for when they're older. Some of my kids have a little bit harder time waking up in the morning, so I go back in and gently remind them, it's time to wake up. <laughs> Nothing beats seeing their bright and shining faces first thing in the morning. While my kids finish getting ready, I make my bed and do a light exercise. I like to use my natural environment to work out in. All this movement in the morning really ensures my day is gonna be great. Next, the kids head downstairs so that they can make themselves a healthy breakfast because they know that a healthy breakfast makes for a healthy day and a healthy body. Next, we get ready to send them off to school. We put on our shoes, grab our things, and double check that everyone has all their belongings and is ready to head off to school. Off they go. I send them off to school where they'll be able to expand their minds and learn new skills. Okay. 
I love it when they come back just to say goodbye one more time. Next, I head to the kitchen to see what my kids had for breakfast. They are pretty self-sufficient and always bless me with leaving everything out to let me know exactly what they had for breakfast and even the things they thought about having but changed their minds about. Isn't that sweet of them? Once the baby wakes up, I take this time to savor nursing my sweet baby as I know this time goes by so quickly. Meanwhile, my toddler quietly looks at books on the couch next to me. He's such a good kid. I don't set a time limit on this as this time can vary depending on how long my baby wants to nurse. Okay, so this was meant to give you guys a little laugh because I have been in so many seasons of life that you know what, sometimes just keeping the kids alive and being in survival mode is my morning routine. Some mornings actually do work out great and I'm able to feed my kids a good breakfast and things seem to be going well. But then again, some mornings can be a total scramble of chaos. And mamas, I feel you because I've been there. I feel like there's so many videos of these women with their perfect morning routine that are meant to inspire us and they often do, but sometimes they just put on all these unrealistic expectations that we feel like we can't live up to, and then we feel like failures. I just wanted to take a minute to take the pressure off and laugh a little bit because I'm pretty sure if you're a mama, you have been in some sort of season like this where it's survival mode, it's nursing babies, being up all night, being tired, just trying to keep it all together. And you know what? If the kids are alive, you're doing a great job. Do your best and feel good and know that this is just a season. Too soon, the season will change and your routine will change and there is a light at the end of the tunnel. I promise you. As soon as things get back to normal and everything and I can get on a good morning routine, I do wanna do a video showing you guys what our family of eight looks like for our morning routine. I hope that this video gave you guys some joy and made you laugh a little bit and that you guys can relate to it. I hope this encourages you guys to keep on going and find those little joys in the midst of chaos. Thank you guys for watching. I love you all and I can't wait to see you next time. Bye.